you see that tree? Dang. So as we were getting to our site, we pulled down the main road to get to our campsite and we were met with a mudslide. Um, so here Zach just went down to see how long it was going to take and if we could make it through or not. We're at our site. Look at this view we got for a week. Good morning. <laughs> like, we're, like we're in a press conference. <laughs> from, the, from the Redwood. <laughs> Dude, last night. Well, first off, I think we should say we decided to come to the Redwoods for a week in a storm morning. Well, first off, the storm decided to move in on the week we planned to come to the Redwoods months ago. Yeah. So, this is our, that was our, last night was our, what, second night, third night here? <laughs> yeah. Last night we got a serious rainstorm, thunderstorm, power and water went out in the park. Sarah woke me up. She thought our trailer fell apart. Well, I woke up because I was freezing cold. So I went to check the heater and our little monitor wasn't on, which has never happened before. And then I went and turned on the light and that wasn't on. The only thing on in our whole trailer was our fridge, so I was super confused. And how ironic that earlier in the day, I was looking for a lantern to have light inside our tent, which, oops, we'll go. Um, I put Christmas lights up. But I was looking for light to have in our tent when it's dark. And as I was pulling out totes and tables and stuff, I turned off the switch that shuts all the lights off in the, in the camper when the camper is not under power. So it was like just ironic that I was looking for light and killed the light. But, so we dealt with that pretty early. Outside in the rain, moving electric cords over here to this campsite to see if there was power. And River just slept the whole time. Didn't he? Because you're just the outdoor baby with this little bird tongue hood. And we probably wouldn't have even noticed the power outage at all if the heating, like the heater and stuff, if our battery switch wasn't turned off. Like, yeah. we would have probably woken up and never known the power went out or anything. Yeah, because, like, the heater would have worked. Everything would have worked off of our battery. But that's a battery disconnect switch. So, literally, I, like disconnected all the batteries from the trailer by doing that switch but anyway we're here now we're alive we're warm we're gonna do a little bit of exploring today today's supposed to be the last day of like the big storm warning um overall it's been fine i don't think it's been as bad as the area's been anticipating it to be Thank thankfully We will check in with you guys when we are exploring. Yep, we'll be exploring all all week. Yee. <laughs>
scenic overlook on the coastal drive near where we're staying. Let's go, let me make it quick. Bumpus is all strapped up. Yeah, because it might get windy once we get out of the vegetation. Go. All right, we just got back to the car, but we saw this is another little overlook, so we're gonna go check it out. Mason, 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 slow. This is why we got the Gore-Tex shoes. How far is this? All right, you see this one over there. Mason, wait, come here, slow, wait. So obviously get down there somehow. Continue to get down there. It's pretty sick. I'm sure Zach will record a little bit, but right now I'm in the car with River. He fell asleep on our drive and I already woke him up once to go to the overlook little section. Um, so I decided this time I would let him sleep and I would just sit in the car with him and Zach's taking Mason out for a little run on the beach over there. Um, you can see it probably looks nicer from his view, but. Check out some merganzers. Check out some merganzers. Good oh boy. This way. This way. Come on. Come on. Good oh boy. on a hike or more of a stroll through the redwoods. It's crazy. It's rainy, but so beautiful. It's crazy. It doesn't even do it justice. Like, look. Oh my goodness. Look. See, I'm hiking. Adventure baby. Look at this. I mean, it's crazy. This is why I got a see through umbrella. living in our umbrella. <laughs> What's up, cranky butt? Alright. Just woke up. But yesterday we got hit with a mudslide. Pretty bad. Power's off, water's off. It's a 
second time this has happened since we've been at this park. Weather has just been crazy. But we'll see how this mud flood looks in a second. We'll see you in a sec. Alright. Yeah, still here. It's just scary walking up on it because look at this. This whole side of this mountain is just like a sheer cliff. So it's like, damn, this shit could just, any of this shit could just go at any point in time. Crazy. All right, we'll see right now. You can hear shit still cracking. Like that's a massive tree right there. All right, let's mop. Take a day or two to clean up.